They come in all shapes and sizes, but knowing what kind of headache you have could help you to find the best relief possible. We find out more in today's Health Matters. Headaches. Scientists still aren't sure why they happen. A lot of the time we don't always know exactly why a headache's coming on, but they can be triggered by so many different things. However, scientists do know they come in a variety of forms. A cluster headache, for example, um, is generally one-sided. One side of the head hurts and usually associated with a tearing eye or runny nose. Not real common but they do occur, as the name implies, in clusters. Then there's the tension headaches. Typically associated with, obviously, stress, poor posture, sitting in front of a computer all day, perhaps. The reason behind these tension headaches remains a mystery. We used to really think that it was muscle tension triggering the, the tension headache. They're trying to do the studies. Still, it does seem to be associated with where somebody's holding their tension and a lot of people tend to kind of crunch up the shoulders and things. Weather-related headaches are common here in southwest Florida. The sinus headaches, pressure, you know, behind the eyeballs, behind the cheekbones, that sort of thing. It's recommended that you keep a log of when your headaches form and what kind of pain you're feeling. Oftentimes, a pattern forms and your doctor can determine the best treatment for your individual headache problem. Reporting for Lee Memorial Health System, I'm John Bafar. Dehydration, lack of caffeine, and certain fatty foods are known to trigger headaches.